Hey folks, Matt from RightOfTheImage.com. I just stumbled across something online that's kind of intriguing and exciting to me. For regular viewers of the channel, you'll know that for a while now I've been saying it's about time we got a 30, at least a 30 megapixel APS-C sensor from Nikon, from Canon, from Sony, from whoever. Um, because we've had 24 for a long time now and it's quite good and I think the tech is there to give us more without loss of image quality. In fact, the tech is probably there to give us more with increased image quality because the you know everything just keeps marching forward on tech. This is interesting. Sony, there's a leaked spec sheet out that shows a new Sony 31 megapixel APS-C sensor with a global shutter. I found this over on DIY Photography. Now, the interesting thing about the global shutter is they're saying that that will potentially offer 4K video at up to 108 frames per second. So uh, that's, that's pretty cool. Uh, apparently, this, these specs were found on a Chinese uh, site. So we're not sure about the probability. Um, couple people are giving them a high probability of being real, uh, but we're looking at a 31.36 megapixel sh uh, sensor, 64-64 by 48-52, and the fact that it'll be able to do uh, 108 frames per second is pretty cool. Um, they've got an uh, all-pixel scan mode frame rate here of 10-bit 42.5 frames per second, 12-bit 35.4, and 14-bit 29.9. So pretty cool because, like I said, I've been talking about this for a while, that why haven't we seen a 30 megapixel APS-C sensor? I think we've had the tech to do a good one for a while, at least as good as what we've had in the 24s and maybe better now. So here we are with the 31.36. So this is interesting. What do you guys think? Is it as interesting to you as it is to me? Um, would you upgrade for six more megapixels? Most people probably wouldn't, but you know we're going to get a few other tweaks and bells and whistles with it. For instance, like this new 108 frames per second 4K video. Those two things might push a lot of people to upgrade, say, their A6500 if the new, say, 67 comes out with this sensor and 108 frames per second. I think a lot of people will be interested in that. Would you guys? Let me know in the comments below. What do you think of this sensor? What do you think about a 30-plus megapixel APS-C sensor? What do you think about this one from Sony? Would you upgrade your A6500 or another Sony APS-C camera if you saw this come out? Does it appeal to you? Curious to see what you guys have to say. I find this quite interesting. Thanks for tuning in. Looking forward to hearing your comments in the comments below, your feedback, and stay tuned. We'll be back soon here at ArtOfTheImage.com.